It's good that we touched on the car crash. That would have been a breakthrough before. But let's leave that topic for a while. I want to talk about family. It's important to you. For you, family is about physical affection and making your feelings known. You're giving me that look. I'm talking too much. Well, let's have you talk, or not, or whatever you feel comfortable doing. Let's play true or false. Is it true to say you're a private person? Would you say it takes a while for people to get to know you? Uh-huh. People can choose their friends, but not their family. Would you prefer to spend time with friends over family? Nothing surprising there. No. You're going to like this. On the table are some pencils and a picture. I want you to let out your inner child and color in the picture. It's titled Happy Family. finished what a lovely family home is your home like this Are you okay, son? No! What are you people doing in my house? Cheryl! Easy there. This isn't your house. Some trouble, honey? No, Lucy. This man here is just a little confused. This is my house! Well, I don't see how that can be the case. We've been here nearly 14 years. Sure you got the right address? Who was that? That was our daughter, Katie. You're in a bad way, son, getting yourself all worked up. Are you okay? I am not okay! I was in a car accident! My daughter is gone! 
And you people are in my house! This is all wrong! You're starting to make a scene. This doesn't make sense. Not at all. Cheryl! You are upsetting my wife. Get the hell out of my house! It's my house! It's my damn house! Cheryl! Sir, you come down here for me? Officer, there are people in my house. They have my daughter. I was in a car accident. That's not the story I got. Can I see some ID? Harry Mason. This is the right address. You know what? This doesn't add up. I'm gonna need you to come down to the station with me. We can sort it out there. No. My daughter is in there, somewhere. She's missing. I'm a police officer, Mr. Mason, and I need you to come with me. These people don't have your daughter. Trust me, if she's missing, we will find her. You know what's funny? I've been a cop in this town for 20 years. Before that, I used to ride around in my daddy's patrol car, so I know the town, know the people. But your face? I don't know you. I keep out of trouble. Not tonight. Well, I guess tonight everything is out of whack. Why are we the only car on the road? No one's sane out driving tonight. Sorry, I didn't mean to... It's okay. What is with all this snow? Who knows? We only covered basic meteorology in the Academy. Hell, we didn't hear about this till it was happening. Barely had time to close off the major highways. It's like the whole town is being punished. It's only weather. Sure. You okay back there? Sure. Holding up. I'm sure your daughter's okay. We've just got to clear this thing up. We should probably get you to the hospital, too, once we know she's safe. <sighs> I'm fine. The human brain is a delicate thing, Harry. Need to get you checked out. Yeah. My dad thought he was tough. He got hit on the head by a punk resisting arrest. He was never the same after that. You gotta look after yourself, Harry. For your daughter's sake. Point taken. Damn, this snow is crazy. Oh, I can't see the road. Wait here. I'm just gonna check where we are. Where's she gone? Thank you. 